Well, welcome back all you bored YouTube viewers. How do I know you're bored? Because you're here watching me play the Never ah, the Neverhood. The Neverhood Chronicles. Uh so we started last time and we got chased by the crazy creature into this TNT area. So we're going to go over to this little ta table workbench our crafting table. <laughs> And what we have to do is we have to solve this, like, switch puzzle to get all the TNT ones over to here. So it, like, switches things, and we need to get it over here somehow. Um, so you kind of just click on things until you, until you get it. It seems seems pretty easy. Which one is this? There we go. Alright, that wasn't too bad at all. We got it. So we got all the duds over there and we put the TNT over here. So let, let's just, let if he wants to eat us, let's give him something to eat. Let's light, I, I would have pushed it a little closer. Oh, push it! TNT! Move it! Oh, good. Man. There we go. We're, we're gonna be. Oh no! We're gonna have to be cleaning up this mess. Oh, what have we done? What have we done? Ah, oh, close the door. Oh, hey, look at it. Dinner. <laughs> All right. So we solved the puzzle. Hooray! So um, we could go over that way and go into the cave that he came out of. Um, but there's some other things I wanted to show you guys. Uh, there's some other puzzles I wanted to do. Other other things. So we'll go back to our central hub. This is that little room that we came out of before. So I don't want to go back there. And I believe this is what we want to unlock at the end. It's like, so we don't really need to go there right now. I'll just end up coming out. This place, however, is both annoying and fun at the same time. So, the songs are just horrible in this room. I hate it. Hate it. Despise it. Um, but there's another data disk here that'll tell us more of the story. We haven't put any of them in the computer yet. We gotta find one. So, what does this button do? I don't remember. Oh, it opens the door. Yeah. Okay. So we gotta open this door somehow, and we gotta solve this little puzzle, and it's like one of those switching puzzle thingies, one of these. So we're gonna try to try to solve this in one episode. I'm not very good at these. So bear with me while I figure this out. I think almost got it you may not be able to tell but I almost have it no maybe maybe no yes okay so we got we got it like we're close got it come on move it got it get it got it go go get it got it come on Get it, got go, come on, let's do this, go, yes, go, get that way. Ah, I hate these things, but I, I think I'm making progress. I can't tell. Um, <laughs> I tell you, I hate these things with, with a deep passion. I, I can never get them. Look, I almost got it. Just need to switch these two. Now, how I do that... I'm not quite sure. So let's just move things around until we. I uh, I think did we get it? All right, that ding, we got it. So what did we do? We opened the door. Yay! <laughs> door opening. Oh, it's just I hate that puzzle. I hate it. But it's okay. So we're in this room with the tiny mouse hole, and we have a computer here. So here's another data disk. 
So, and these discs, they like tell the story of the game, of what's going on, so I think we found three of them so far, so he just pulls them out of his stomach. They probably have a whole bunch of stomach juice and digestive fluid and crash the computer, but we'll see. So yeah, we got one and two, and four. Don't know what happened to three, so let's... Um, hello! Me Willy. Me Willy Trombone. Willy Trombone. These discs tell a story. Story about good. Story about bad. These discs are all that are left of the true story. True story of the closing of the third age. Willie really know that once you know this truth, then you know what to do. Listen, I tell you. So we're missing that disc, so we're not going to be able to hear the story just yet. The cool thing is, though, that no matter where these computers are, they all have them saved, I guess. So it doesn't matter what computer we put them in. And I just lifted up that hole. That was pretty cool. So let's turn on the lights to this place. So this this is the the part that I hate because all it is is him walking. Oh look, there's that glass that we needed for the water. There we go. Um I I can't really quite read that. I'm not sure you can either. Um, but this is the part that I hate. It just goes on forever. It's a never-ending hallway. Never-ending story. Um, there's another disc here. But, I mean, we need to go down that hall because there's a disc and a button that we have to press. Uh, um, I think we need the lights off for this. What does this do? Oh. Um, um, not quite sure what that was for. Okay, 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 you're done, you're done. Leave it away. I don't care. Um, what happened? There we go. Uh, so yeah, we'll have to go back, turn the lights off, and go back down there, because it does something with that one button, so... Turn the lights off, maybe? And go back again. I hate the dark. I hate it. I feel like Slenderman is gonna just come out and get me somewhere. Ugh. Down we go. There's symbols here. We need to remember those symbols. I... I think we gotta write them down. So... Let me get a piece of paper. So it's like some kind of square root symbol, then an arrow, and then dot dot line morse code. So we got some square root arrow morse code. We'll, we'll need that for future reference. Just letting you guys know. So, but now, now we go on the long and laborious trek. And this is probably the most boring part of this entire game because you're just walking and with me trying to run this through an emulator it's slow anytime it's trying to load a screen so it's just gonna take us forever to walk down this road it's like that giant wall with all the people who've died in military service that great wall somewhere it's like that in DC you know that wall it just goes on forever. I used to always think this was a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. I don't know why. Probably because it is. I want to snack on one while I walk down this place. Because it takes freaking forever. Just It just keeps on going. I hate it. <laughs> this part, I hate it. I, I actually despise this level. Or, well, not this level, but just this part of the game. Because it takes forever, like I said. 
It, this might be the entire episode of just walking. Walking with these caveman paintings and just, just walking. So anyway, while we're walking, let me give you some more background. I didn't really do quite the, as good explanation as I should have. So we are this character, Clayman. And he is like the head god Clayman's favorite creation. But the god Clayman kind of went corrupt with power, mad with power. And so we're trying to stop it from being corruptive. And uh, I keep... I, I'm doing it again. I'm not doing very good. I'm horrible at summarizing stories. I always failed that part in school, summarizing stuff, because I, I just, I wouldn't know what to summarize. But anyway, we are Clayman, and we're going on this adventure solving puzzles, and we are slowly collecting the story from the, from the, this guy, it seems, almost. But he has the crown. But anyway, so, those data disks will tell us the story, so, it's all good. I don't have to do too much explaining, I just have to solve puzzles, which I can do. I can I can solve puzzles. But it looks like here's some more caveman paintings. Keep having to click to go places. Oh, this takes forever. No, keep going. I guess he needs a break. Let let's take a break. Oh, okay, keep going. We gotta get through this video. Come on. Keep going. But it's pretty cool how they made this entire... Oh. It, it That's pretty trippy. It's like 3D, but not... It's weird. Anyway. It's really cool how they made this entire thing out of clay. They actually built clay models and filmed it with a camera to make the game as it is. So it was like pretty new, um, considering 3D animation was starting to be big. Um, it was kind of underrated because of all the 3D that was coming out, all the polygon movements and whatnots, and this was still in claymation, old chicken run style claymation, but it's well done. I believe they said that it, it took over two tons of clay. We did it! We made it to the end for this little stupid disc, this data disc that we will need in order to complete the game. So, and we get an... A boring view so all that just for that data disk and now we get to walk all the way back all right we got this that we could do this come on oh this takes forever forever <laughs> I'm telling you, it's just, it's a fun game, though. It grows on you. It's so much fun things that happen. There are a couple of other characters, I believe, eventually. We'll see a TV guy. Um, I believe there may be one more little creature thingy. But, I mean, it's all fun. The jokes in here are pretty old school, but it's an old school game for a hardcore old school crowd. So, it's a fun game. Love this game. If only he would walk faster. I wish... I'm, I'm, I'm like, pressing W twice, double tapping W to try to <laughs> just try to run. Oh, what'd I do? What'd I do? Oop. My bad. Ah. Oh, now I broke my mouse. See, I'm... Oh, God, what did I do? What happened? Oh, my gosh! No way! We can... Oh, wow! I never knew this! Holy cow! Oh, man! I am... Oh, God! Oh, sh shoot! I keep hitting that! Why? Oh, man! I didn't know we could read this! Holy cow! I uh, I don't want to read all. Oh man! But this tells the whole story of Clayman. Oh God! Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh! No, we're not reading this. Forget it. Forget it. We're getting out of here. I never had to read it before. We're not reading it now. I I didn't know you could read it. Holy cow! That's crazy. Um, can you imagine reading all of this? No. 
we're not at that reading level. We're at a fourth grade reading level here. We have a fourth grade reading level limit. None of this. No. <laughs> Dang. That that would take me like six episodes right there. Oh gosh. No. <laughs> oh man. Forget it. But we're almost at the end, I believe. Almost at the end. Phew. Almost, I believe. Come on. Almost. Kind of, sort of, almost. We're, we're never coming back into this hall again, so don't worry. Don't worry, people. Don't worry. We're not coming back. We're not going to read all this. I don't want to bore you to death. You'd probably become one with the wall by reading this. That's probably what happened to those guys. They were trying to read, and then they died and melted into the wall, and that's why... That's why they're like the way they are. So, yeah, that's what happened. Oh, we're done with this building, thankfully. So don't worry, we're never coming back. Oh, it's just a bloody long hallway. And can you imagine reading all of this? No. My peanut butter and jelly sandwich. I'm taking my peanut butter and jelly sandwich with me. Taking it with me, and you can't stop me. I'm peeling it out of the wall. Such a fun game. Such an old game, but oh, it's totally worth it. Totally worth every penny. It's actually a very rare game to find nowadays. Um, I have an original copy, so... Yeah, it's a fun game. They only made, like... 10,000 or something of these, but totally worth it. It's a collector's item now. It's a great game. And now, oh, turn off the light. Turn it off. Good boy. And let's get out of here. Oh, back to the annoying music. So let's, let's go ahead and put in those data disks we found and see if they all make sense. They all go together, hopefully. So where are we? Perfect. We'll watch all five. Um, hello! Me, Willy! You know, no, no, we're just, we're just gonna Me skip Willy to where we were. Trombone. So, the true story. Here we go. It all start with Hoborg. Hoborg. A being who had to create. So yeah, this is, this is that god guy I was talking about. He had to. <laughs> so he makes a world full of beauty and wonder. This world, the Neverhood, a world where he could live forever and ever more. Hoborg thought this world would make him happy. But it make him sad. Walking around his big, beautiful new world make him feel all alone. Alright, so there we go. There's a little bit of the background story. This whole Borg guy, he created this world, and he was all alone. He felt so alone. So, I believe he made us. He made, he made the people of this world. God, I want to get out of this house. I hate this song. Get no, open the door. Open the door. It's a little derpy, but all right. So that was the long hallway. We're never coming back here again. Thank God. All right. So we'll we'll do some more puzzles next time. Probably this one right here. This one's a pretty fun puzzle. So, uh, so long. Thanks for all the fish. Hope you enjoyed this series. Um, thumbs up if you want me to keep going. I probably will anyway, despite what you do. Because <laughs> uh, it's such a fun game, and I love it, and I think it deserves to be featured. So, so long.